welcome back everyone to another video and in this one we'll be taking a further look into the fuchsia operating system that google has made and this actually takes a bit of a turn into the gui side of things so first of all what you will notice in our main screen like that um that like in linux we have multiple shell environments so i can switch between them using the very familiar um alt and f uh, alt and function keys so f1 go gets me to the uh kernel uh, debug message page uh, f2 gets me to uh, my first shell f3 to my second f4 to my third and f5 to my fourth uh, apart from that this is a full fuchsia build so it does have the system slash apps uh, folder and that actually has quite a lot of gui based application that we can try so first of all we have something called the spinning square view and the command is simple as launch spinning square view and this should show us pretty much what we expect a square that is spinning now to kill this simply uh, turn it or uh, switch to another shell and kill all and launch and that should kill our spinning square view so we are back where we started so next we have something called basic windows manager basic wm so for that launch a uh, basic and then underscore wm and it should launch us into a very basic version of a windows manager probably built around the material theme and you should see it any second now and this is it so again as i said built around the material design kind of a look here with a similar icon ui and stuff like that so if i click this in a moment it should launch a terminal window either that or it completely crashes because that's how new the code is and unstable it is right now so it seems that it is wanting to launch a terminal window it's nearly there and it seems that it really doesn't want to do anything so i think our best option is to kill this one as well next we have something called hello compositor now it uh, basically just runs the um, some basic mods art uh, based graphics rendering and Mozart is uh, somewhat like a Mesa driver for the Fuchsia environment and probably works as a renderer too so Mozart is the one thing that is basically doing all the rendering here and it's all software rendering at the moment I guess you can tell that by how slow it's rendering and then we can of course go ahead and kill it as usual next we have something called hello material which would create a material ui like environment that we can possibly interact with if we aren't uh, if we aren't able to interact with it it will probably crash that seems to be uh, kind of the way things are right now all right so this is the basic kind of uh, material ui and if i click this button it should technically yes it does say button tapped one time then two times but the issue is it's actually really slow so i've clicked it now and now it's updated it so yes it's pretty slow it even says slow mode so i'll give them that but apart from that it's not really working that well it's great to see something like this in development something from scratch brought up and in a 
working state and easily accessible to everyone but it will take a long time to develop into a proper product so this was it for today's video a few gui based examples of um Fuchsia OS uh, and its Mozart compositor driver or software renderer whatever you want to call it So this is it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all in the next one